briefcase, briefs, and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In 1973, the Supreme Court of the United States heard Roe v. Wade, a case centered on the idea that the right to privacy protects a woman's right to an abortion. The case involved Jane Roe, a single pregnant woman, along with John and Mary Doe, a childless couple, and Dr. Halford, a licensed physician who challenged a Texas law criminalizing all abortions except when recommended by a physician to save the mother's life. Roe and Doe's brought a class action lawsuit, and a three-judge district court granted declaratory relief to Roe and Dr. Halford, holding the law unconstitutional under the Ninth Amendment. The U.S. Supreme Court ultimately heard the case and ruled that the Texas statute was unconstitutional. The case acknowledged the controversial nature of the abortion debate, but focused on constitutional measurement free of emotion and predilection. While the Constitution did not explicitly mention a right to privacy, the court recognized a right of personal privacy under it. Justices found roots of privacy in various amendments relating to marriage, procreation, contraception, family relationships, and education. This right of privacy included a woman's right to abortion. However, the state did not consider a fetus a person in the 14th Amendment, but had interests in protecting the pregnant woman's health and potential human life. As a result, regulations varied depending on the stage of pregnancy, with the state allowed to place increasing restrictions on abortion as the period of pregnancy lengthened. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit LSE.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.